authentic country pie. I love it. Things are going fantastic at the Big Apple Berry Works. Apparently, every berry loves my authentic down-home baking. I heard about I heard that it is so Ooh, look at me. I'm a simple country berry. I make simple pastries for simple people. And I dress too matchy-matchy. What? She does. I don't care how she dresses. She is taking all my customers. We need to show this country bumpkin how things work in Big Apple City. Whoa! Hi! We're your neighbors. I'm Raspberry Tart. That's my truck over there. Oh, and uh, this is Sour Grapes. That's your truck? <laughs> oh, and come drops. <gasps> so pristine. Wow. It is nothing compared to this thing you've got going on. You're the freshness fairy on the block. Oh, thank you. So, what can I get you, new food truck friend? Strawberry pie? <gasps> Strawberry strudel? Pano strawbear? That's a new one. We'll take everything you've got left. Everything? Eee! Ooh, uh, mm, mm. I sold out. Who did it? Me, I did it. <gasps> I hope this whole small town country berry thing doesn't get old. What do you mean? Well, this is Big Apple City. You've got to keep things fresh or customers just move on. The country berry bit is cute today, but if it starts to feel stale, it's... Bye-bye, berry. Oh. Shortcakes. What's wrong? I sold out of everything. That's awesome! Awesome today. Tomorrow? Bye-bye, Barry. Hmm. My country Barry bit will get old! Barry's will get tired of my baking! The universe put you here for a reason. Why would you think that? <gasps> Mystery solved. Look! Come on down to the Raspberry Supreme for authentic country treats. Yeehaw. Oh, no, they did not. Come on, Shortcakes. We're fixing this. Raspberry Tart, what did you do? What? Berries like my authentic treats better than hers. Your treats? Those are my treats. You bought them and stole my whole, uh, my whole vibe. How dare you? Your treats were strawberry. Mine are strawberry and raspberry and have a bow. See, anyone can do country and the berries have spoken. Oh, hello, strawberry shortcake. You're from the country. Are these authentic? Um, well, the berry who baked these definitely knew what she was doing. <laughs> Maybe a bit heavy on the raspberry. If y'all like mixing flavors, how about I whip up a batch of my authentic every berry country coffee cake to give you city berries a real treat? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Raspberry made me feel like being myself wasn't enough. But then she tried to steal everything that made me me. You can try passing my treats off as yours, but there's only one authentic Berryville baker in Big Apple City. And she's not going anywhere. Bye-bye, Barry. I am going to squash that berry. Well, go get me a napkin. Boom, Barry! Oh, popsicle stick! You scared the strawberries out of me. That's the idea. It's nearly frightful. It's my first frightful in Big Apple City. I need to come up with a creepy Cake. I'm sure you'll come up with something frightfully fitting. <laughs> oh, if you see the ghost, say hi for me. <clears throat> I'm sorry, the what now? <gasps> Blueberry, wait up! <sighs> uh, hold on. <laughs> Did you say ghost? Yup, J. Quincy Cupcake. He was the owner of the Berry Works when it was still a cupcake factory. Oh, J. Quincy was a perfectionist who checked every cupcake for the tiniest blemish. Some folks say his spirit still roams the berry works at night. Who judging any baker working late and alone? But you've 
ever actually seen Jay Quincy Cupcake's ghost, right? Huh? Oh, golly, I wish. I've tried to meet him for years. Maybe tonight you'll be the lucky berry. Have fun. Okay, a cupcake obsessed ghost. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Great, great, great. Yeah, not creepy at all. <laughs> Strawberry Shortcake is scared of ghosts. Let's give her a frightful treat she will never forget. Ooh, okay, it's fine. It's totally fine. You're just gonna grab your lucky spoon and bake. There is absolutely nothing to be scared of! Ooh, just the lights, Strawberry. It's just the lights. Stop wavering! Oh! It's just a plant. <laughs> Rusty sign, strawberry. <laughs> you're just gonna, you're gonna get it together. <laughs> be like blueberry. Be like blueberry. Be like blueberry. Holy hazelnuts! You're never gonna find inspiration for scary if you're too scared to be inspired. <sighs> Calm down. All right, what's that? Bad plumbing? Seriously? <laughs> <gasps> it is I, Jay Quinty. Who dares bake in my presence? No, no baking here! It is you! Strawberry shortcake! <laughs> one time I don't want to be recognized for my baking. No one likes your gross country treats. Go back to Berryville! <laughs> <laughs> Yaha! The universe told me Strawberry was the lucky berry, and now I finally get to meet the ghost of the berry works. Put her there, Mr. Cupcake. Hey. <laughs> oh, hey. Ah. Oh, have you met Strawberry Shortcake? She's a perfectionist, just like... Huh? Hello? Whoa, this is the J. Quincy Cupcake. Oh, we should try one of your cupcakes. No, Blueberry, they're hot. That's fine. I've got ice cream fingers and he's a ghost. Ow! That's hot! What are you... Gumdrops, you three are the reincarnated spirit of Jay Quincy Cupcake? <sighs> I knew it. Raspberry tart? Sour grapes? Bread pudding? Why are you trying to scare me? <gasps> That's it! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! Ow. Just checking. It's my spooky surprise cake. Each bite has a new hidden flavor waiting to shock you. Raspberry, then grape, then bread pudding filling. Mmm, that is terrifyingly tasty. How did you ever come up with it? Really, Blueberry? We were together the whole time. 